I'm gonna be running around this area for a very long period of time. I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm totally fine. Don't worry. It's just some explosions. That's all. Oh, you know what? You know what I'm willing to bet on? That mosaic Gordo is hiding something back there. If it is hiding anything, it is hiding the fountain. Like, where else would the fountain be hidden? Still doesn't answer the question as to where the other Tangle statue would be, or the Dervish statue. Up there. Okay, how do I get there? How do I get there? This, this kind of stuff, this kind of parkouring, it's rather problematic at times, but... This is the way forward. Okay, uh, can I make that? Okay, well... I guess I found the fountain, which wouldn't be back there, but... Nonetheless, it's something. And hello, Quantum. I've not seen you in a while. Um... No, there's... There's supposed to be two more... Dervish statues hidden about the place. But where the hell would they be? <laughs> it's just... It's so difficult to find. Or I just don't know where I'm looking for, but I have definitely not found you before, I think. You're new. Oh, quite the sight to gaze upon the sand sea out there, no? I've scoured every corner of the desert, and everywhere I look, that sand sea stretches to the horizon. It makes you wonder just where the heck on a far, far range you are when the slime sea is nowhere to be found. Indeed. I'd imagine we'd be on the completely opposite side of things. Like, that's the only thing that would make sense to me. Like, where else would you be if there is so much sand sea around the place? Nonetheless, though, uh, what this place does not have, at least, other than sand, uh, it does not have the Dervish statues. So where the bloody hell are they? Two of you. Two of you is all I need. Come on, where? One of you! One of you is all that I need! It's not gonna be up there, right? One of you is down there. You are here. There was nothing up there. Ooh, okay. That's fine, that's fine. Not entirely sure which dervish one created that, but sure. It's up there. Okay, how does one get up there? Again, the whole parkouring thing, it's... It's strange, but really, that was not enough. Alright, fine, fine, fine. I'll find my way up the way that I'm supposed to, I guess. Slow and steady. I'll fly my way up there. You will be restored, I tell ya. So, come on. Here we go. And... Dervish, go whoosh. That's it. Haha. <laughs> All right, well, that only leaves... Uh, did we read you as well? Oh, I did not think that one through. I did not think that one through. Let me see. Can I get the distance required for that one? Yes, I can. Easily. Hello, Hobson. Oh, it must have been a hack of scorch. Yeah, okay, we did read that one. Yeah. Okay, well, anyway, uh, that means... Let's see, where were they? There was one of them over there. At least one right over here. I don't know where the other ones are. Maybe they, maybe something happens if I manage to restore everything, but... Not too sure. I mean, I can give it a shot, but... It's gonna be difficult. So, first things first. You... Restore to full glory. And with more than enough time, we also restore you to full glory. Restore you to full glory. There we go. And then I've got no clue where the others were. Somewhere. Anywhere. It's a long distance running for sure. Either way, uh, that's all fine and dandy. And... Yeah... I kind of want to bring these tangle plorts back home and whatnot, but we don't need them. So, this can go back. I want to keep the Gilded Ginger. I'll keep the Prickle Pears for the time being. I need Silver Parsnips. So, I want to at least make that Gordo explode. We know where it is right over here. 
and I guess we can pay a quick visit to that area. I mean, it is the last possible thing that we could explore on the far, far range by the looks of things. So that would bring us very close towards the end of this adventure. Very true. But there's still some tiny stuff that I would like to do once we are actually done with that, which is a little bit of decorating. I want to get all the Titan drills and whatnot. I want to make all the money we can get. So we'll be busy for a while anyway. Which means... Hobson, your final few messages. Like, I'm not assuming we're gonna go beyond this even further to some other area. Like, we have found all the slime, so... Two doors, Beatrix. Life is filled with moments where there's two doors and you can only choose one. I came to the far, far range because the search for the unknown is in my bones. And in time, even a thousand light years away from Earth wasn't enough. So I searched for secrets within the ancient ruins that led me here. This place was my ticket to go even further. What did you find, Hobson? What did you find? And where did you end up going to? The ruins are actually great engines that allow for travel through space and maybe even time. After years of study, I knew how to activate them and I alone would be the first to cross over into the true beyond. It was the ultimate adventure. But then there's that other door. I met Thora and fell in love. What are the chances of that? She had a piece of my heart and the universe had the other. Two doors, Beatrix. And you can't take both paths. So then what door did you decide to take in the end, Hobson? Did you decide to stay with Thora? And are you just with her in secret? Or... Did you indeed choose to go for adventure? What was your choice? I chose my door. I went back to the ranch and promptly sold it. I packed my things and took a tour of this beautiful land one last time, leaving these little notes for you. There was time I said goodbye to the life I had. My hands and feet tingled as I approached this monolithic warp terminal. What lay ahead of me was an adventure unlike anything I had ever known in my life. I stepped onto the platform, my heart racing. Uh, but in turn you did have to leave Thora behind for that. Oh boy. And this is the last one then. Right? Nothing beyond here. Except for the sand slime sea. Oh dear. They do make the jingle jingle! Are there more? I hear more jingle jingle. Or is this just me again purely getting lucky? <laughs> It's just me getting lucky. I'm, I'm sorry, Hobson. I'm getting distracted by gold. Uh, what was your last message? But I didn't go. You didn't go through? I had packed for a new adventure. But it wasn't going to be beyond space and time. So I said a little goodbye to what could have been and headed to Thora's ranch. I'm looking forward to hearing the sound of those wind chimes. I've never been in love before. Never known anything like it. It's time I got to knowing what all the fuss is about. So good luck to you, Beatrix. Always remember to use your head, but let your heart do the thinking every now and again. It might surprise you. Hobson. And doors like these. Ah. Uh, that is nice. So in the end, he did choose to go for love. Like, Yes, adventure is one thing, but the heart wants what the heart wants. And sometimes that's also what the mind needs. So, with doors like these, discover where Hobson's journey ended and started once again. Right on Thora's ranch. And we have to complete the slime PDF for pro style, complete adventure mode and set out for what's next. We've not completed adventure mode yet. Okay, then how do you complete adventure mode? That's the question. Uh, we have to snare a hunter Gordo. We can definitely do that in the future. 
maybe. Score 50 points in a single game of Slime Ball. We've not played around with that. We have not played around with Slime Stage. Uh, we're definitely not playing around with Rush Mode, that's for sure. Send an adorable chick to a fiery end. The same place you're now destined to go. <laughs> really? You have to send a chick or two inside of the incinerator? That's... Wow. Just wow. Uh, but... Yeah, no. Um... I guess that's... Does Hobson's end. And... That leaves us with... Just doing whatever the hell we want to do. Which right now means more slime exploration and whatnot, but... We can restore the oasis as, as much as we want. Right now, though, I think I want to head back home. There is still a whole lot left to do for me. And one of those things most definitely is to check up on all my pumps and whatnot. Because I want the new resources that are available in the glass desert. We are far away from home and... I do wonder what door we will end up choosing in the end. Will we go back to Casey? Or will we remain to take this life? Like, just because we might want to go back to her does not mean that she will be happy with that. Who knows, maybe she moved on. She did say time and space move differently, perhaps? God knows what might have happened. Either way, it's time for me to go and try and find my way back home. Wherever the hell that may be right now. And... Yeah, I'm gonna check up on all my resource and whatnot and all the pumps so first things first find my way bloody hole back home like my god all right here we go nice and safe and sound back into the oasis everything is fine we've got our portal back home and there's one more slime key although i don't fully understand what we would need that for like i have got two more keys available to me right now but yeah, what do you use the slime keys for? No clue. Either way, thank you for the money. Um, I'm going to store these gilded gingers somewhere safe. Somewhere that allows me to do whatever the hell I want. It's still not empty. Oh, you guys are probably without water. Yep, you pretty much are without water. I've been gone for a long time. All right, well... I'm gonna store these right at the lab. Like, this is the safest place. This is also where my golden ports are, so... This should be fine. Nothing to worry about. But no, in the meantime, uh, really quickly going past all of my farms and whatnot, all the ranches, extensions. Making sure everyone has their water and then... Well, what I want to do is definitely read my mail right now. And after that, the pumps and situations and whatnot. Alright, that's all my drones back up into running order and everything. They'll be fine. So, let's see what kind of mail we've got. This is the mail from Hobson. It was a mail from Casey. Life is different now. I had a year to think about things while you slept on your way across the stars. I think it almost scared me when things got easier. And when I finally realized that what we each have now is what we wanted all along. Because if you're still the girl that I know... You're happy out there on the very farthest frontier. And I hope the happiness you feel now lasts forever. I hope that the sunsets over there are as gorgeous as they are over here. And that if you search far enough on a rainy day, some rancher out there has a taco stand you can visit. I realize that last one probably isn't likely to happen, but it sure will be romantic, right? I'm glad to have shared a part of me with you, Beatrix Labo. And I'm glad and I'm happy to know that maybe one of those stars I see up there is you in the sky. That's nice. Huh. So yeah. I guess in the end we did choose the door to go over here. Like to go over here to the far far range, it's It's not easy. Especially when you are in a relationship. Like did we already break up before we left? Did we already realize at that point that stuff didn't fully work out for us? I'm not entirely sure. Anyway, um... Okay, both of you were actually 
being busy with selling all the plots. Uh, that means you, my friends, have had nothing to eat for a bit. I'm very sorry. Don't worry. I'll fix that mistake. They're making money for me. It's all fine. Don't worry. There we go. Do I have something to eat? That's all fine. So many bloody plots. Uh, well, within no time, we should be having access to at least a Titan drill, which is fine. Uh, I'm going to go back towards all my normal pumps, drills, and apiaries. And maybe see if they are already gone to disappear. And they do indeed disappear, which means, good news for me, I've got pumps and apiaries and everything to place all the way in the glass desert now. Although, by the looks of things, it seems I might have forgotten to actually empty my drills at one point, because they do have got another round to go. Oh well, that's fine. So, right now I am faced with an interesting predicament. Um, you guys are slowly emptying the final little tidbits of this so that I can remove and turn it into a chicken coop. Perfect, we're almost there. Um, I can get the next 7C upgrade, but I have not found the next one in regards to the three drill blueprints. So if I were to get this, which I totally am going to do, because hey, it's rank wonder wolf. That's perfect for me. So definitely taking that. I get the abyssal pump blueprint next and another slime trophy. That's a whole lot of money though. Um, but what do I require? So much money down the drain. God, but it's, a, it's for a massive pump. Um, I have not found the other pumps just yet, and I don't know where I would have to find those. So... I'm probably gonna have to explore the glass desert even more. But for that blueprint that I now got, the Titan Drill, I need Mosaic Plots. I definitely should make this. Uh, I am gonna grab as many Rat Plots and Mosaic Plots as I can get, and I'm gonna stuff them inside of this thing. Um, they last for 12 cycles. Damn. A secret drill manufactured by 7C that offers the highest chance for rare resources. Also perfect. I'll take that. So, rat plots, mosaic plots. Let me dump as many of them into the refinery as I can. And we also get another meal from Casey, but... Casey, I'm very sorry. I'm currently very busy. I'll get to you very shortly. And that's the last remaining rat plots that I had, which, surprisingly enough, wasn't a lot. I had like 400. It was only on this side, so uh, you guys need to eat more. Are you eating enough? You are eating enough, right? Yeah, you totally are eating enough. But Perhaps I should just increase the size of every single silo towards six slimes. Just maybe. I mean... That seems to be a very balanced amount that I can have, but this is fine. Uh, we are going to go to Mochi's Manor. I need to have access to all the possible, well, mosaic ports that I can have access to. Uh, meanwhile, are my pebble ports all still in the same area? Sort of. Yeah, that works out nicely. Totally fine. All right, mosaic ports. Please tell me you guys have been busy. Please. Oh, you totally have been busy. All right, well, time to waste all of them as they directly go into the refinery link. And sure, I could have sold all these mosaic ports for a whole lot of new bucks, but this is for the greater good as well. It's fine. And with that, we have the resources required in order to construct our Titan drill. Six of them, right? Perfect. That's all we need for the time being. Rat plots galore. Now we just need to get access to the advanced or the Titan pump and the Titan apiary. But those will still take a little bit of time. And in the meantime, I still don't have access to any other teleports. I probably missed a red teleporter somewhere. No way in hell that I'm going to find that. But silky sand. If I'm gonna get that from anything, it's probably gonna be from a drill. So, we're gonna go right back to the glass desert. Um, I do not even know where I would want to place a teleporter over there. Like, assuming that we can place a teleporter anywhere where we would want, I'd say we'd probably want to have it somewhere in the middle right over here. That would be the best possible location, right? 
it's easy access to the entirety of the glass deserts. So, I think that's what we're gonna do. But first, we gotta get there. And while I'm running here, I'm also realizing that I'm a complete fool. Because I can't actually place the Titan drills down just yet. I can only place the pumps down. Ugh, I'm an idiot. I'm an absolute idiot. I'm gonna go back. And I'm also instantly, actually, gonna get myself the silver parsnips? Was the silver parsnips for the mosaic slime? It was the silver parsnips. I need 25 of them so I can make the big boy go boom. I'm very sorry, my friends, but I swear this is for the greater good. It totally is. I have to help one of your brothers out there in the wild. It will be fine. And meanwhile, with a teeny, 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 tiny bit of luck, this is also the last cycle for you guys. Just maybe, please. Perfect. All right, that's what we're looking for. That means once we return towards the glass desert, we can place our drills down. And I guess that before we head back, we can also read up on Casey's meal. Another tour. Hi, Bia. There's another tour coming up, and I have a feeling that this will be the one. So here I am, packing my bags and thinking of you. Maybe this is how it felt when you were leaving for your big adventure. Lots of excitement, lots of butterflies. And even though I know you're so far away, I keep thinking that maybe I'll catch you somewhere out there in the crowd. If that ever happens, I promise I'll sing a song for you. And it wouldn't be the first time. Casey. <sighs> adorable. Very re-adorable. That day, Beatrix took a moment to reflect. She thought about Hobson and Thora, and the adventures she'd had exploring the far, far range. But most of all, she thought of Casey, and wondered where life would take her next. Well, apparently... I guess that is where Slime Rancher then thus ends. Interesting. It's not what I had expected in regards to a possible story. I had kind of expected it to be told in a different way, but uh, I will leave this entire credit sequence for when we truly are done with this entire let's play, because right now I still got a whole lot of stuff to do, so let's get right back to that. For every pioneer on every new frontier, be brave, be bold, and stay wiggly. Anyway, achievement unlocked. Uh, the adventure continues. Very, very true. And in, at the moment, also, money still streaming in. Uh, let's see, where is this one? The adventure continues. Complete adventure mode and set out for what's next. Currently, I'm assuming with the story in mind, uh, we need to make more money because we need to pay for our trip back home. Uh, Starman from Hobbs and Twilgers. Uh, yeah, we need to make a whole lot of extra money because we need to fund our way back home because, yeah, Casey is waiting for us to one day maybe return. And I think that's what we're going to do. Once we have got all the money that we need, we'll return home rich. We've had our adventure. She has had hers and we can tour and who knows what the future may hold. But right now, uh, Hobson, hi. So you're finally someone here from you. Hello, Beatrix. I just want to say thank you for taking care of the old ranch. I know I left in a bit of a sorry state from, from what I hear. It's looking mighty fine these days. Makes me feel all warm and fuzzy knowing that it's in such good hands. As a little thank you, I've activated three secret vaults that I built years ago to stash a small fortune of mine. I had always planned on using it as a walking around money in the great beyond, but I ain't needing for that, for that no more. But you know me, I like a good adventure. I'm not telling where the vaults are located. Go explore! Of course you're not telling me where they are. Of course. Well, if there's riches and whatnot in there, that might be useful to fund my way back home to Casey. Maybe. But yeah. Um, are you nearly empty? You are nearly empty. Right? Okay. Are you going to take those last 50 out? Come on. Take them all. 
Final check, is everything gone? Yes, everything is gone. That is absolutely perfect. That means demolish this. Uh, demol... Yeah, demolish plot. Did I have to do that for the others as well? Uh, for the others I didn't, but for the silo, they probably want to make sure that you all know what you're doing. So, I guess that's fair. Anyway, chicken coop. Just how we like it. And then we need to place all the... The briars in there, so... Uh, the briars I had actually deposited inside of the overgrowth. Thank god I still remember. There we go, all safe and sound. Who knew that silos could also contain living animals? It's total animal abuse, I know. Uh, let's see, I need one of you. Thank you very much. It will be fine, don't worry. And I do hope that you slowly will produce some extra roostros. Just in case, because... Yeah. Anyway, this is fine. That means... I think right now everything is on all the ranches. Completely the way that I would like to have it. We've got every single chicken type being produced right now. We've got every single slime producing ports. And thus any kind of request. Except for, uh, for Victor. Because he definitely wants to have his... Very specific slimes scattered from the wilds. Uh, we'll be fine. But no. Uh, I want to return right now towards the glass deserts. Uh, we're going to keep our eyes open for these vault things and whatnot. And I'm going to make a big Gordo go boom. Uh, new upgrade available slime key. A single spare slime key. Just in case you can't seem to find the last one. Well, that's very nice. But... Would there be more hidden? Like, we've got all the slime keys from this area. We have got nearly all the slime keys from the glass desert, I believe. Because I think that this the Gorda one, uh, the mosaic Gorda, might actually be the last one. Like, there's only one more. So it's got to be that one. Yeah. Well, time to locate it. Time to make it pop. Time to grab that last key that we need. And of course, while we are here, assuming that I'm going to place a portal anywhere over here, would I have enough spots available? I've got some here, one, two, three. Uh, whatever I'm going to do, it's going to be very spread out. That's the feeling I'm getting from this, because I'm not going to be placing anything inside of here. There's not going to be any drills up here. No, so whatever I do in this area... Any kind of things that I place down will be very much spread out. But, theoretically... Okay, uh, one, two, three over here. Let's say that we do this right now. These need to do their thing anyway. We place all of you down. You get to do your thing. And the other three, I theoretically just place back in the Indigo Quarry, where they would need to be no matter what. Uh, I've got two spots over here in the future. And one over here. So those could maybe be for the pumps. And do I have three other spots? For a moment I thought that sounded like a gold slime. Uh, I've got one, two, three, right over here. Yeah, I think if I use this area for one pump or apiary or a, uh, a drill each... It should be fine. But then the main issue I've still got is where do I place my portal home? Like it's... It's not the best. Maybe if I place my portal home right over here, then I can run around and get all the stuff that I want from all of them at the same time. I guess that can work. Yeah. It's all future plans. But I'm getting the general idea for them right now. Either way, uh, fire and brimstone raining down from the sky and coming up from the ground. And this is hell on earth, basically. And I need to be all the way up there. So let's fight my way there. All right, here it is. And we got to have to find our way back up there. This remains to be a very annoying one to get to. Like, you have to properly make use of your jetpack, but even then, it's like... Ah! Very problematic. Very problematic, indeed. 
to get exactly the way it would want to be. Like, this just... It doesn't feel right to do it like this. Already, I'm like, ow. Oh, no. Just stay still. Restore our energy. There we go. That's fine. This is not correct. Do I have to do it from all the way up here? Like, for real. Getting to this Gordo is the most difficult. It has to be done from here. Like, how else? How bloody else? We've at least got that fountain over there, and we can try and see if we can find more of the stuff over there. Hold on. If stuff turns into a tar slime, does this thing instantly evaporate them? Huh. That is intriguing. Uh, this is... No, it's gonna be enough lift. Well, it's enough lift to get on top of here. But it still doesn't feel right. Uh, by the way, I think that's the case. If a, if a tar spawns, that th bubble just destroys them. Either way, yes, friends, greetings. I have come from far and wide to get you all these silver parsnips, so you better take them all and enjoy them. There we go. Have fun. Okay. Uh, no slime key. I was hoping for a slime key. Oh, no. Get over here. All of you. No shenanigans. There we go. Uh, oh, there is a slime key. There we go. And that's just normal junk. That's normal stuff. A little bit of money. I'll take it. But eh, it's fine. So where would this then lead? Like, no matter what, we are still looking for at least a few blueprints hidden here and there. And maybe... Nope, no kill the ginger. There is more stuff hidden around here, and I'm still looking for blueprints. Tell me you've got a blueprint. Come on. You've got the master pump. A pump that sives the most resources with a very high chance for rare resources. Well, apparently, not the most, because there's another one that is titanic. But that explains where they are found. Those level 3 ones are in this area. But I've not found the other two. And likewise, do I really need to make these right now? Well, perhaps. Because I do want some of the resources here. There's got to be more. There has got to be more. Are you another type? Uh, another master one? Come on. No, a very warp depot. Not what I'm after. Uh, finding the blueprints in this area, it's gonna be a mess. Like, I see one of them all the way over there. Can I even make that? I think I can. I totally can. But no, this is it's just messy. This place is a maze. A towering glass sculpture. A beautiful glass structure from the glass tested that resembles a monolith. It's beautiful, very true, but no, where the hell would I find all the others? Like, there is... <laughs> I've got 9 out of 22. I've been looking around for them. I can't say I've been ignoring any of them this time around, so... Uh, I just don't know where to look for them. There's too many, that's what. And they're definitely not up here, but... That's fine. Totally fine. I think I'll just leave this for the time being. Um, I'll probably spend some extra time just going through the area, finding what we can find, like you all the way up here. These things are hidden in such a way that there's no way I will be able to find all of them. Moss Apiary. Well, I'm happy to have at least those two. Those are actually the most important to me right now. Uh, I see you. Did I already open you? I indeed did. Well, I at least have got the two most important ones. All I need right now is to at least get the resources to make these. And then I need to be able to get all the money to actually get the next few Titan rank extractors from the 7C Club. 
Like, that's currently the biggest goal I've got in mind right now. So, how long does it take before you are done? You still need, like, five minutes. Still, the tangle remains so weird. Yep. Have a few mosaics. I don't need those. That's how you repay me. I free you. You this is trying to blow me up. Well, thank you. Oh, boy. The main slime rancher adventure might now be over, but that doesn't mean that we are done with our shenanigans. There is more money to be made after all, and likewise, the allure of the 7th Sea Reward Club is calling to us.